In this video, we'll show you maintenance steps for the EcoFlow Smart Generator. Each time you use the Smart Generator, be sure to check the fuel level, oil level, and internal battery connection. The fuel level can be checked by taking off the fuel cap and looking inside. You can also check by turning on the generator and looking at the remaining power percentage on the LCD screen or in the EcoFlow app. Take off the maintenance cover. Unscrew and remove the oil dipstick and wipe it clean. Reinsert it without screwing it in and take it back out to check that the oil level is within the recommended range. The engine will automatically power off if the oil level gets too low. Be sure to add oil as needed. Reinsert the dipstick and screw it back in securely. Take off the maintenance cover and ensure the positive and negative terminals of the internal battery are connected correctly. Open the LPG cylinder valve and use soapy water to soak all the connections on the LPG hose to check for leaks. If bubbles appear or bubbles grow, then this indicates a leak in the LPG hose. If the leak is at a fitting, then turn off the valve on the cylinder and tighten the fitting. Open the valve again and use soapy water to recheck at the fitting. If the leak continues or if the leak is not at the fitting, then stop using the generator and contact customer support. Proper maintenance and servicing are essential for safety and reliability. Service the generator based on the schedule you see here. The EcoFlow app makes this easier by providing reminders based on when maintenance was last performed. Please note that some steps will need to be done by a professional. Here are a few precautions that must be followed when performing maintenance. Carefully read these precautions on maintenance and personal safety. Turn off the generator. Turn the engine switch and the fuel cap breather valve to the off position. Take off the maintenance cover. Unscrew the lid and the oil dipstick. Tilt the generator to empty the oil into a pan. Put the generator back upright. Refill the oil to the proper level. Wipe the oil dipstick clean. Tighten the oil dipstick and lid. Put the maintenance cover back on. Take off the fuel cap and remove the fuel filter screen. Clean it with fuel. Wipe the filter screen and reinstall it. Reinstall the fuel cap. Make sure to tighten the fuel cap. Take off the maintenance cover. Remove the air filter cover. Take out the foam filter. Clean the foam filter with soapy water or a non-flammable solvent and let it dry. Saturate the foam filter with oil and squeeze out the excess oil so that it does not drip. Place the foam filter element back into the air filter. Put the air filter cover back on and tighten the screws. Put the maintenance cover back on. Take off the maintenance cover. Remove the spark plug cap and remove the spark plug with the tool provided. Check for any fading in color and remove any carbon deposits from the tip. The spark plug is still in good condition if the porcelain casing is only light brown. 
The spark plug should be replaced if worn or if the insulation is peeling, cracked, or dirty. Check the model of the spark plug and that it has the right gap. Reinstall the spark plug and cap and put the maintenance cover back on. Unscrew the bolts. Take off the muffler cap, muffler, and spark arrester. Gently brush off the carbon deposits on the spark arrester and the muffler block with a wire brush without damaging or scratching them and replace these parts if they are. Reinstall the spark arrester, muffler, and muffler cap. Feel free to reach out to our technical support team or refer to the user manual for more information. Visit our YouTube channel for more great tutorials on EcoFlow products.